Hello, everyone, my dear friends. I'm going to knock your door. Talk, 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 talk. Ah, uh, tomorrow. It's a. Uh, uh, Yeah, Saturday, and uh, Saturday the fourth of fourth uh, of uh, December. Saturday the fourth of December, which which is uh, uh, what you call it, new moon, last day of the of the month ninth month. <coughs> it's going to be. Like usually, it is uh, like a uh, new moon. It's uh, like a very important day of the Buddha Shakyamuni. And not only that, this uh, tomorrow there's the eclipse. And the eclipse is not just a uh, usual, but it's really uh, going to be full except eclipse. And uh, around uh, like Greenwich time, it started early in the morning, and maybe you can have a look on the internet and you can find exact date exact exact time when it's going to begin and when it's going to fully fully going to eclipse and uh, so please have a look okay and but anyway it's uh, the morning of the fourth of uh, of saturday fourth of uh, december the saturday is a new moon so therefore please try to do some virtuous practice first of all for Buddha Shakyamuni's anniversary of monthly monthly like uh, celebration and uh, on top of that is eclipse it's uh, so wonderful that we can uh, whatever practice we do it multiplies millions and millions of times so that that's quite helpful and please try to do whatever you can virtuous practice Whatever we do, positive or negative actions, it is going to be multiplied, and so, um, so we can do something that, uh, that in short time we can ac accumulate virtue in the immense way. So, you can just as there's a, like one day more, so you can prepare it maybe on the during the time of the eclipse. On Saturday, if you could try to stay at home and try to really focus on on some virtuous practice, and that would be so wonderful. It's my request, and uh, and uh, if it's possible, like a Saturday and Sunday, but at least Saturday, if you could stay at home, uh, if if it's possible, the full full day, but at least maybe the morning, if you could do some practice that's really good and a practice that's related to our body speech mind yes and uh, so anything to that is negative we try to avoid them and engage in the virtue yeah and then also please try to do whatever practice you're doing focus on them and combine that uh, our practice done in some way that a great teacher who is the Omnish Long Chimpa would say and uh, in Tibetan Joa Sem Jingwish Mikpa Me Nje Jingwa Tambana Sumde Palam Dele Mita Mepa Sum this four line what it means is uh, as a preparation the sublime uh, sublime motivation as main practice during the main practice uh, try to adopt a state of mind that non conceptual and as a conclusion perfect at the end I conclude whatever we have done like uh, conclude with the dedication for all happiness for all beings so the preparation with the with enlightened attitude and uh, while whatever we're doing without any distraction try to keep our mind and non-conceptual state at the end whatever we have done and 
if you could dedicate for the freedom of all things and beings to the enlightenment of all things and beings then such a, such practice will never be wasted yeah and uh, of course when we begin with the, the enlightened attitude <clears throat> then uh, whatever we do will become meaningful and when we are whatever we're doing it's important for us to be aware and try to adopt our state of mind in non conceptual so that it will be really uh genuine and perfect uh, training or meditation or practice whatever you want to call and then when you have done and uh, always please do not forget to dedicate for the freedom of all sentient beings whatever virt- virtues you have done so that it would never be spoiled otherwise you have done a action but without dedication it can destroy it easily one instant negative thought can destroy everything so but to make it something really powerful and something that cannot be destroyed or lost always please conclude with the dedication don't, please don't forget to dedicate whatever virtuous actions we have done then as usual uh as tomorrow is going to be with the shakyamuni day i would uh begin with uh, calling the buddha shakyamuni <clears throat> de ata om mone mone maha mona ye soha de ata om mone mone maha mona ye soha de ata om mone mone maha mona ye so om mone mone maha mona ye so om mone mone maha mona ye so now i will call upon guru padma sambo who is no other than um, buddha himself as he predicted that he's going to manifest as guru pache om om bhadra guru padma se de 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 calling the guru bache is something really very powerful it is it is known that the guru bache padma sambo is no other than the buddhas of three times he is uh, like a uh, representative of the buddha's past and his nature of the buddha's present he is a source of buddha's future so he is known as the buddha, nature of the, the buddha's time calling calling of gurumbache is like uh, calling all the all the enlightened ones of three times now we shall call upon lord of great compassion the generosic um, call upon Buddha Amitabha
shall call upon Buddha Amitayu, Buddha of Longevity, Infinite Life. Om Marani Jivente So Om Marani Jivente So Now we shall call upon Mother Tara who protects, who remove all kinds of dangers. Om Tare Du Tare Du Re Ye So Om Tare Du Tare Du Re Ye So Also for us to have uh, intelligent intelligence and wisdom we shall call upon the Buddha of of wisdom, the Manjushri Shri Om Arabaja Nadi Om Arabaja Nadi Om Arabaja Nadi Also on my request is always please try to remember uh, four boundless and six parameters four boundless and the uh, un like unconditioned love compassion joy and impartiality it is one of the most important thing for us to, to be aware of aware of if we have loving kindness unconditioned loving kindness then that includes everything and then if we have unconditioned compassion wow that is really wonderful and if we have uh, joy instead of jealousy that's so wonderful and also impartiality so these four are serves as a antidote of uh, our selfishness when we have loving kindness and that really eradicate like a selfishness and also if you have a compassion that reduces aggression anger and even we have been very angry, angry and aggressive but try to cultivate compassion <coughs> wishing all beings be free from suffering and its cause that's what we call the compassion so therefore uh, try to cultivate compassion uh, it's really very very important for us and then I always try to cultivate joy instead of jealousy when we thought crosses in our mind like uh, jealousy that ruins everything what we might have but if we rejoice happiness for others and that makes everything successful and then likewise to make this love compassion and joy impartial to everybody equanimity so these three topics helps us to really eradicate many of our problems and therefore to do them on the basis of six transcendental act generosity discipline patience diligence concentration especially like uh, wisdom are very important and I really wish you all wonderful uh, practice during the eclipse because if you practice uh, during the eclipse that everything what you do will be multiplied countless times so therefore you have the virtue of as if you spent mm, years but in short instance you can gain the results so therefore please try to be aware and try to do whatever we can virtuous practice saving lives feeding people and and uh, committing for example uh, tomorrow try to remember actions by body 
speech and mind try to do virtuous actions by body, speech, mind, for the well-being of all sentient beings, which purifies all the uh, negative results and uh, make everything possible, positive. So that's I uh, really wish that uh, you all have a wonderful health and happiness and peace. May all your wishes come true. And uh, so please try to make sure that you have one day. So prepare your time, your schedule, so that tomorrow is the day for all beings and for you to uh, to enhance on the path to be free from suffering and cause of suffering. This is my request. Have a wonderful day. All my best wishes to every one of you. Thank you.